Hey everybody, it's Fred with Game Blips. Uh, ready to do my uh, next nerd block, or arcade block opening, unboxing. Wow, I can't talk tonight. Uh, just did a stream, just did uh, uh, another unboxing. That's why I'm wearing the same clothes. I'm not scumming out. <laughs> but anyway, uh, doing another arcade block unboxing. Um, the last one I did was actually for April. And then um, the one that I've got now, I'm super behind. Sorry. Uh, the one I've got right now is for uh, May. And uh, like I mentioned on the last episode, my last unboxing, I'm on the fence right now. I don't know if I want to spend all this money on just Arcade Block. I love the selection. They are really stepping up their game and everything. But... Um, I don't know. I just I just can't justify the price. Uh, it's it's still really expensive, and that's that's kind of my problem with it. Um, there are other boxes, blind boxes, you know, different. Uh, there, there are different companies out there that are that are delivering the same type of thing, and they're doing it for a lot cheaper. I, a lot of the problem is that uh, that they're doing it. They're doing it for Canada, so they got to do international shipping. So anyway. Here we go. Maze. Arcade block. <clears throat> what? Okay, so. <clears throat> As usual, we are starting off with a shirt. Let me slide this around here. Huh, cool. Man, these guys are just doing it up. Ah, there we are. So I've got this Kingdom Hearts shirt. That's pretty cool. Hot Keyblade action! Alright, let's that over there on my desk. Other desk. Same desk. Just more desk over there. Alright, and... Oh no way! Uh, Pac-Man salt and pepper pots, little little shakers. I'm gonna open these. Oh, these are nice too. They're they're ceramic. Got a little S for salt. This one must be for blood. <laughs> Wait, no, actually, deep. This, this is where all the deer shake out uh, for pepper. So, no, they, they feel really nice. Um, I think these are going to have to invade the kitchen. <laughs> and they don't make noise, so I don't have to request replacement ones. Thank goodness. <laughs> Ow! Um, my packaging came apart in shipping, which is not a big deal. I got a, a Skylander. Um, I totally don't play this game. So, um, yeah. Maybe I'll have to ship this out to somebody I know that does. But it's a uh, Drobot. Looks like a little... Uh, little mecha dragon thing I don't like I said I don't I don't play this game so I don't uh, I'm not I'm not in I'm not the pulse of society when it comes to Skylanders or the other collectible ones the amiibos and things like that so yep I'm, I'm out on that one uh, next up this is a uh, an arcade block exclusive it's another little keychain thing this is cool too it's a uh, it's a little uh, retro 8-bit-ish kind of keychain for a, um, a treasure chest. Da -da -da -da. So that's cool. And actually, this is the thing I was looking forward to. Video Games Live Level 4 Arcade Block Edition. Uh, another exclusive. They, uh, they got a bunch of people together to do a uh, essentially a soundtrack. Um, I heard they were, uh, they were doing this. I completely lost touch with gaming reality for like a month 
Wow, my face is lighting up. It's lighting up. <laughs> Got a 32-inch flat panel over here that's uh, playing some anime. So. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not too close to get seizures. All right, so there's that. And... This is retro... ReadRetro.com. Looks like a. Uh, oh, this is cool. So it's a magazine for uh, retro gamers. Oh, I dig this. I, I like this a lot. <laughs> cool. Karate Champ versus Yi R Kung Fu. Oh, this is this this has the nostalgia of like old school video game mags. Neat. Even even some new stuff. They're uh, they're talking about Street Fighter V. You know how it's going to be coming out exclusively on PS4. So that'll be cool. All right, and here we are at the bottom. So we have <laughs> arcade block wants to know. Oh, this is cool. What did you think of this arcade block? We'd like to know. Uh, kind of a feedback card, but on the back of this one it says the cheat code I want to use in real life is blank. <laughs> so what is what's your real life cheat code? Fill out this card, snap a pic tagged with hashtag arcade block talk for a chance to win a Retron 5. Approximate value is $140. I might actually do I hope I'm not too late. I probably am. Because this is last month's. Bummer. Because after doing that uh, that review of the Retron 5, I would like to get my hands on one of those. Because ever since uh, uh, moving, I have a lot less real estate available to me for all my gaming needs. And a Retron 5 is exactly why, uh, why I said certain things in my review. And a lot of it is, yes, I have the hardware. Yes, I love using the original consoles. But I don't have the space for it right now. Everything is in a big tub. Um, with the exception of a couple of my consoles, uh, but uh, but anyway, that's that's a different discussion altogether. Let's go back to the arcade block. Um, the headliner this month, the Pac-Man Salt and Pepper Shakers. The box said Salt and Pepper Pots, but this one says Shakers. Two of Pac-Man's greatest foes have made their way to your dining table. Don't worry, they're not causing trouble this time. Shake these ghosts of your meals to add some flavor to your food and spark some nerdy conversation at your next dinner party. Right. <laughs> and they're also talking about the uh, retro magazine that they packed in there. That's cool. Uh, then on the back, we've got the Kingdom Hearts t-shirt. We have the Skylanders figure, the uh, Video Games Live level 4, the... Oh, it's a zipper pull. That makes it even cooler, not a keychain. Treasure chest zipper pull, and then the retro magazine. So that's that. Uh, that would be last month's arcade block. Uh, like I mentioned in the beginning, and I've been kind of alluding to since I even started doing these unboxings with arcade block, I'm, I'm contemplating switching, jumping ship to a different one. Uh, we'll, we'll see. I might do one more with them. Uh, but, you know, when I, when I started this back in January, so I've, I've gone through th th four of these now. Uh, when I started doing the orders in January, uh, the the original box kind of left me wanting more, and I think that's kind of the general consensus that I found of all the videos that were that were done for that particular month. Uh, so it looks like they're super duper trying, you know, good on them, definitely. Uh, but still, it's it's so hard to justify the price when I can get a very similar kind of box. Uh, to uh, you know, get for, for my own personal needs, and of course, and to to, uh, to deliver extra content for the site to do these unboxings. Uh, I, it's just it's hard because it's out of my own pocket. Uh, so you know, we'll we'll see how that goes, um, and uh, we'll go from there. Uh, like I mentioned on the last episode, pardon my tissue paper crunching. Uh, on the last episode or last unboxing I did for Arcade Block. Uh, my uh, my boy, J Boy Pac Man, Pac Man, uh, is on a new podcast, 
and that's called uh, Nerds of the Round Table. Uh, he's not officially on the roster yet. They're going to be doing an, the next episode with an intro for him and uh, uh, another one of his buddies, and then uh, they'll be full in full swing with the episode after that. And that's going to be their Halloween in June. Uh, they'll be talking about their favorite costumes and candies and you know other different things like that. Um, hopefully I make the cut or our, our old parties that we used to have on Halloween that makes the cut. Maybe something cool happens. I don't know. Maybe not. I'm asking for a lot. <laughs> Do what you need, J-Boy, because this is your own other show, other podcast. So anyway. Uh Catch up with us. Uh, we have a forum. Some people have been using it, but uh, we do uh, we do site announcements. We have generalized uh, talk for all the different generations of consoles. Even PC gaming, it happens. I did PC gaming tonight on the stream. It happens. <laughs> so... Um, <clears throat> Yep, we have that. We have our Facebook. We have, um, actually, it's my personal account, but uh, on Instagram, if you use hashtag GameBlips, hashtag, uh, you know, we're on Twitter. We are on G+. We are on Facebook. So check us out. And uh, this is Fred again. We'll see you on the next episode.